Hey, you're checking out a tutorial by Epic Media Box. Please like, subscribe, and comment. This is the homepage. Um, after you log in through your uh, Amazon account and you've uh, connected it to your internet connection, either Wi-Fi or Ethernet port, we highly recommend you connect it to the Ethernet port. Um, it's faster streaming rate, faster connection if you just connect it directly from the router to the box using your Ethernet port. Um, if your box is far away, the other side of the house or side of the room, we highly recommend you um, get it installed near your TV. Um, it's, you could call your cable company or internet company, just let them know, hey, we want the router moved to our box. Hopefully, it shouldn't give you too much trouble and shouldn't charge you anything. Um, but we highly recommend you connect it. Um, you have the router near your TV, so you could connect it to an Ethernet port. Or if you don't mind running a cable along the whole room, you know but it's up to you. We want to make sure the screen's adjusted to your television. And to do that, we're going to go to settings, display and sounds. And we're going to go to display. You could adjust your resolution or leave it on auto, or you could adjust it to your uh, television resolution. But we're going to calibrate the display. That's what we want to do. We want to make sure that set for your TV so what we're doing is adjusting it making sure that everything is fit in the screen and once you've done that you accept it and then we just scroll back okay so we adjusted the screen to fit perfect for your television now we're going to get to XBMC and Kodi to do that we're going to just go from settings to applications click on app we're going to scroll down to manage all install applications we're going to scroll all the way down to SPMC we installed SPMC it's the latest version of SPMC um, it runs better on a fire TV box which is the unit we're running on right now um, so we want to make sure um, everything we install uh, is the best possible um, software that works that's most compatible with the box so this is what we're using it's the exact same similar thing to Kodi XPMC it's just uh, it tweaked a little bit better for the fire TV so we're going to click on that and we have the option of launching the application um, force stop is kind of a quick reset it freezes on you you're in the middle of a stream and for some reason you're back out of it and it just freezes on it um, you just uh, go home and before you launch it again, you just press the four stop. It's kind of like, a, again, it's like a reset button. Um, you have the uninstall button, which I highly recommend you never touch. The clear data button, which I recommend you never touch. And the clear cache, um, over time, you probably want to clear that over time, but it should automatically be set for you. And again, uh, we're just going to launch it. This is, again, this is to get inside the XBMC software. XBMC slash Cody. Click on that loads up and this is your home page uh, there's a music section here there's the video section here there's a weather section where you can see the local weather you can set it up so your, your local hometown and three other destinations and uh, three other locations and we'll uh, show you how to do that in a few seconds I'm sure to give you a quick walkthrough um, as you can see we set up uh, we put the best possible add-ons um, as you can see right here seven of them these are the ones we highly recommend, obviously for TV, home entertainment, uh, latest movies, latest TV shows, live sports, um, some live TV. Uh, we also have a um, you know, limited amount of music videos and, um, and movie trailers and a lot more. We'll get through all that. Um, these are the top ones we, we put on there. As you can see, I'm just scrolling around through the home page using the directional pad. Um, I'm on my video section here. And then we added a lot more add-ons right there. You just scroll down and just highlight the add-on section. Click on that. A lot more add-ons we put there for you. I'm going to back out there real quick. Uh, we have a music section. Again, we put the seven best music add-ons on there. Got your Pandora. You got a lot of stuff to choose from. A limited amount of music. And then we'll go through all that in another video. We also have a program section. Programs is uh, kind of like technical support, and um, really don't want to touch that. Um, 
until you're a little bit more expert, um, you probably want to stay away from that. Then we have system settings. This is all stuff. Again, we've done the hard work for you. We've set it up um, to make it as easy as possible for you guys to um, use this device. It's kind of a plug and play. You know, you go from, you just plug it into your TV, you plug it into your internet, and it's good to go right out of the box. We've set it up with the best add-ons, the best repositories, all done and easy as possible. And what I mean by that is we even added a kind of like a shortcut section. And uh, if you scroll down, you can see the little highlight, the blue highlight. And if you scroll down a little bit more, there's two little options here. This one right here that's highlighted blue is a power and you can exit out of it. Um, and then we have the star, which is kind of like your favorites. And then uh, we set it up for shortcuts for you. So when we click on that, you have a movie box. We already have movie box for you. It's a library like 4,000 movies. Um, it takes a while to load up because it loads up literally all 4,000 at once. Um, but it, once it loads up, it's good to go. Check it out. Latest theater releases. This is all the movies still in theater. Some of them are in DVD quality. Some of them are camera. Um, you won't know until you actually play the video. Featured movies are all the latest movies uh, still in theater. And, uh, you know, they're featured there. So, again, they're also um, camera versions, DVD quality versions mixed in. Latest TV releases. This is a list of the latest TVs that were added. Here's another uh, playlist of latest TV shows. Here's another uh, playlist of the last seven days of TV shows. Um, it takes some time to load up because it takes, literally, it loads up the seven days, uh, the last seven days of the latest TV shows from around the world. So, it takes a, a minute or two to load up, but it does do its thing. Um, 1080p movies, a playlist of uh, all the latest 1080p movies, classic movies, all mixed into there. Movie box sets, Godfather trilogy, stuff like that. Um, biographies, not biographies, but like the um, filmographies, stuff like that. Favorite actor. Uh, if you want to get live sports, uh, NBA games, NFL games, pay per view, UFC, WWE, this is where you want to go. The live sports. You know, again, we made it as easy as possible. We put it, there's a even made a shortcut for the WWF, MMA, boxing fan there. Um, some of the latest fights. Yeah, and that's basically it. Hey, you're checking out a tutorial by Epic Media Box. Please like, subscribe, and comment.